What's up guys, RJ here. And uh, today was a good day. So today, um, we did a few things to the race car. Basically, let me tell you the, the story back. So last Friday, I went and I tested the car and it was freaking amazing. This thing makes insane power. Uh, I mean, 580 horsepower, you know. It, it's not insane, but I mean, I'm used to riding at 475. So basically, I went to 100 you know, 105 more horsepower, and that makes a huge difference in my book. So plus, uh, I mean, something that, that was kind of crazy was that my car was horribly set up in regards of, of suspension. So we just did the whole corner balancing and basically made sure that camber caster and tow was perfect. And I mean, my car should feel like a different car. But anyway, so I don't go into that aspect of the deal, uh, deal blah, 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 detail. I'm going to uh, post another video in regards of that. But anyway, so I just signed up for the Drift League Pro 2 shootout, which is this Friday and Saturday. And today is Tuesday. I literally signed up today simply because I wanted to drive that bad. And uh, I'm going over the checklist of stuff that I need to do for my car to pass Pro 2 Tech. And I literally have 95% of it already done because the Drift League requires all that in advance but I was missing a few things. So what did we do today? So today we went to NRG and we picked up a few things and I'm gonna show you basically an open box of all these things that we picked up. By the way, Jason at NRG, thank you dude, you've been with me awesome, awesome for the past few years. You have always supported me and you know what? I am so incredibly grateful to you and the NRG family for just uh, always taking care of me. You guys are truly amazing. Thank you so much. So anyway, to continue, what do we have? First and foremost, wait, it's backwards. First and foremost, ah, a new steering wheel. And why am I changing a steering wheel? Let me first show you this little beautiful piece. Nice, super clean. I love it. It's actually super sturdy, which I, which I love, and it's very plush. And as you guys know, I've been in love with my yellow wheel for the past, I would say, five years. I've literally been running that same style wheel for the past five years, which is actually in my car right now, so you guys could see right there. And what it is, is the fact that the drift, that is a wooden base wheel. It doesn't mean that the inside of the wheel is wood, but what it means is that the trim of the wheel is wood. So, uh, Pro 2 or, you know, uh, Formula Drift, that's not, I'm sorry, yeah, Formula Drift, that's not allowed that. It has to be a full suede or leather or basically all around resistive, you know, steering wheel. So that is why we went to Energy today. We picked up this one and we're gonna put it in the car. Another thing that we picked up was this amazingly beautiful new design quick release that they've made. So as you guys know, you know, there's a ton of quick releases in the market. NRG has created some amazing ones, but look at the difference in this one. I'm actually gonna do it here. So it looks nice and normal, like just any other quick release. And then look at this. It is not the circular way anymore. It is basically a full uh, D style, I don't know what to call it, SFI spec, as you guys could see, uh, quick release. I mean, it's it's incredible. It, it's really incredible. If you guys see the back over here, you guys, just, this is little spring. So basically when you pull the thing, this contracts and you get the D in there. Ah. There you go. You get the D in there, that's what she said. And what you do is that you literally align it and boom, and it's done. So basically this new design uh, allows for the steering wheel in race uh, situations to never, ever, ever slip. If you guys remember the older styles and most common uh, quick releases are basically like a little circle with a whole bunch of little balls. And what happens is that when you press, you know, the, 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 the release plates, those little balls fall. 
it doesn't mean that they are unsafe they've been in the game for a very long time and they're still very good but this new style it is 100 percent extremely race developed and energy did an amazing amazing you know design in in literally creating this super super crazy d style location it's you guys could see it's like super crazy just goes in it and you know i mean there's no way in heaven that this thing could ever slip or nothing like that and literally super easy to put on part another little part that we picked up which i need very much for my car it is something that i've never had in the rear but i am supposed to have it is this little toe straps holy crap and these are freaking beautiful look at this oh my gosh Oof, look at that color and these are the prisma toe straps oh oh my i mean you guys need to see this that's my steering wheel and that's the strap oh my gosh they are oh it's so freaking amazing and as you guys know this is my color uh, actually next year the whole livery I'm, I'm gonna stick with the same livery but everything that is teal or it looks kind of blue right now uh, it is going to be that yellow so yeah anyway so what this where this is going is right here let me show you guys let me grab a light real quick there you go we got some light and basically I just welded this into my car and it's getting painted right now there's some special paint and uh, this is just dirt the paint is actually going to match very nicely but anyway this is going to go right there and this is going to hang in my rear end right there and uh, if there's any sort of collision or anything the tow truck or whatever could pull me from this string so incredibly incredibly excited to be running this little part it is extremely necessary for all race cars and if you don't have one i would highly recommend for you to go to get nrg and you could pick some super dope colors this is the uh line drop green i freaking love it it is a prisma editions like there's race seats and yeah they're super cool and lastly, the last thing that I picked up from them is something that I already have in my car. I've been using them once again for the past five years. And it is this SFI rated roll cage padding. As you guys could see, they are SFI 45.1 developed by NRG. And basically what this does is that this goes in your door. So there you go. These are beats. Can you see? Yeah, you could see the energy right there. This this has been in my car for like the past two years. I actually made a little cut in here because they were, you know, kind of floating. So anyway, I'm going to replace those with these. And that is going to just give me a little bit more comfort. I have some in here as well in my head. And yeah. So anyway, without going too crazy, these are all the parts that I picked up from NRG today. I am extremely excited to give the race car, the interior and exterior, a little update. So uh, if you guys are wondering where to get your roll cage padding, head to getenergy.com. They sell it. If you're wondering where to get your toe straps, go to getenergy.com. They sell it. If you want a wheel adapter or quick release, go to getenergy.com. They sell it. So anyway, guys. Thank you so much, NRG, for this amazing wheel. I love it. In the next few weeks after competition, we're going to go back to NRG and we're going to engrave a few things in the steering wheel and basically make it my own. So, peace.